So hi, this is Paul Feng. Today I'm going to talk about the writing the ebook. So creating the best ebook is by tapping to the emotional drive summarized from the Wesley Atkins article. And this is actually very important um, like flow uh, to tapping into the uh, by, uh, the uh, reader's emotional drive. So what do I mean is your ebook is actually creating a raving thing. Um, I'm still learning. As you can see, uh, my ebook here, Some Into Profit, Make the List, Get the Sale, is all about the list building and uh, is published a couple months ago and uh, so far it's two review and both five star. But I try to, you know, follow the process and to make sure the ebook's book uh, is, is good in Amazon. I'm still learning. And uh, so far, uh, my note regarding to uh, selling the eBay, which is a uh, um, understanding the first one, uh, the, the everything even before I talk about the first one is need to have wrapping fans. So at the beginning, uh, you can do something the uh, promotion, you know, um, uh, helping other people uh, by uh, provide the uh, free book. Uh, they sign up to your uh, list so you can uh, send them newsletter. And s starting from uh, beginning as the uh, subscriber and. Uh, Probably uh, will soon be your paid client, uh, either purchase some affiliate product or become your coaching student. And then become your raving fan because they can receive value more than the money they spend. <clears throat> That's what I'm talking about. So why do I say I have to create a uh, raving fan? Because as far as competition is getting tougher, right? And Amazon Kindle on competition is huge, right? And but the but it's very important the potential of creating a large recurring income from Kindle is so much easier than the setting up with the website for free uh, other Amazon uh, um, FEA still link with this customer support refund, right? So a need to exceed the reader's expectation. That's what um, uh, this is talking about, uh, Raven fame. So, the firstly, the first step is create an excellent e based on the emotional drives, right? The reader tapping emotional drive is we want to know more about the uh, spe uh, specifically who will be reading our book, right? So that's important. And I can show the way actually to find them. Well, probably the best way is using the Facebook, but I'll talk about that later. Second, what type of particular solution we need to provide them? to create happy and revving customers. So you have to provide something they want, they need, and solve their problem. It's not something that you want to make a quick buzz or making something uh, mass produce uh, um, publication to uh, uh, making money, uh, uh, you know, here and there a little bit and accumulating a fortune. Um, so that's the second point. Third point is that you want to understand their mindset. To, to read this mindset is important important to figure out um, their why, the big why, W-H-Y, for seeking the solution in the first place. For example, my book, Science Probably Be All This, and uh, the uh, uh, book, which is um, written so I have to buy the book, is uh, uh, lots of newbie they do not know. Uh, most important thing about the internet marketing is about traffic and email marketing. And uh, some of the other things important is regarding to the collaboration, the partnership, the blog, and so on, uh, video partnership with other people. When I'm talking about partnership, it's not mean that you have to form a LLC partnership. No, I'm talking about just you have a partnership, some people can cooperate, help each other, even though you never meet that person before. And uh, outsourcing, uh, and uh, the creating, the, of course, your blog, your video, which is so, uh, that is part of social media. So that is the key of making the a uh, nice success. And lots of people actually they're just starting, and guess what? They tried this for two weeks and they give up. No wonder so many people wake up, give up and say that the internet is doesn't work. And the, the best way actually make it work is you have a one full time job and you still making income. And and on the side, you'll be able to purchase some traffic here and there and promoting your product, affiliate product. And as a matter of fact, that person do not really recommend the affiliate product to, to promote because even create your own product because either create your own product or video product or just creating a website and try to promoting your website using SEO that's all big no because that's more advanced 
And uh, I know that the book talk about you know doing that first, but uh, I feel that whenever start that is, uh, I doing those as well. And I didn't do particular. I have in Bombay in the JV so I have a a nice uh, a big uh, budget website, <laughs> and I have a uh, uh, spend lots of money on SEO, but that doesn't really really help, especially uh. Google actually changed entire SEO algorithm. You know, you can build like uh, thousands or tens of thousands of backlink. But if your backlink is not those uh, uh, P89 that uh, pop, pop, uh, you know, the uh, popular domain, it's not going to help too much. And plus, the Google is not only look at the backlink; they also look at the the um, uh, the content of your the uh, that you produce. So, so uh, long story short, let's go back to a square years. We want to um, write an ebook and to understand the why and seeking solution. First place, just like I in my book, I writing the solution. Say, okay, that doesn't work. And what should I do? And uh, do this. Okay, work, try to work and invest in smart time doing the solo ads. Build your list. Why in a book I talk about a bit about how you actually be able to uh, exchange what we call click banking, okay, click swapping the click from other online marketers so you can actually all grow so uh, grow your own list, right? Next fourth is find your readers, sex, age, income, family size. So it was very hard to find those, but why not? Nowadays it's very easy. For our demographic data, uh, demographic data like Facebook and like uh, um, the queen cast and um, if you're doing the Facebook okay uh, um, you go Facebook go to the uh, facebook.com and there's something slash ads slash audience dash insights okay you know you'll see uh, here in the below video and uh, uh, if you first if, if you are the first time it's open they will show you some of the you want to if you want the Facebook the people connecting to a page Okay, no, it's everyone because you want to search the audience, and you can find that uh, in the location. Okay, all your next states, or you want to, and more country. Okay, just for the simple of this demonstration. Okay, I just say United States, and uh, I'm not gonna, gonna change that and age. Okay, and gender. You want to particular your ebook is focus on men, focus on women. And interest. Okay, this is very important because that is a topic about ebook. Okay, ebook maybe you talk about the, you know, maybe is a business opportunity. I just say for example. Okay, uh, my book is not business opportunity. But I just say for example, if ebook is business opportunity, all right, then they will actually show you the uh, some business opportunity and sub uh, category. And you can choose them or you can not choose them. As for example, I choose family relationships about the family. Okay, just say, okay, that's, uh, that's not there. They will show you the demographic, how many people are actually interested in this topic, particular topic, 6% women, 34%, 36% men. So when you write a book regarding to this business of in favor in your relationship, and uh, uh, you want to <coughs> actually keep in mind, even though you're male author, you want to keep in mind about 64% of the women actually interested in this topic. So that gives you a tremendous advantage, and they are more, more about the uh, things that people are connecting to and people not connecting to certain type of events. So you can actually further narrow down and find your demographic. That's why you want to, um, you know, do what I'm suggesting here. Find a sex, age, income, family site. You can find them all, of the, all of them from the Facebook or from the. Um, the uh, coin cast um, Facebook is more easy of personal finding, okay. And then you want to find home. Um, uh, many people uh, like your uh, keyword in um, Facebook, and which is um, uh, people actually as as many people people like your uh, keyword, right? Um, let me see, find as many types. You know, that's very good. Then you want to find how or what does the market wants or needs a solution to, right? Uh, what does that market want solution? And I understand this is too small, okay? But good is I put the outline and in, in the end of this video, okay? That much better. Sorry about that previously. So this session is going to form the basis of book, why? Right? So what does the market want or need solutions right now? Once you know demographic, you pretty much will be able to understand 
um, the the basis of the book, the, the form, the basis of your your idea book. Then once you have a basic idea book, next stage is fifth. So we need to identify the biggest pain and point. Like Anthony Robin talked about that we all driven by two, right? Two things. What two things? One is pain, another one is pleasure, right? Either some people are just talk about this this way. Um, uh, different topics about that way, but narrow down is really all by the two big category of pain and So we want to find what is their pain point. The reason to do that is most people dream by the pain, they most people dream by the pressure. So uh, I would say, for example, myself was dreamed by the pain because I was so broken, no money, and five bankruptcy before. So I had tremendous drive want to actually make online business work. So this is my pain point, all right? So, this is actually looking for one is a Q and A community form. So why we come is go to the uh, Yahoo or the Quora, or you can go to one of my favorite as metafilter.com, and uh, you can actually find uh, type the question and just go to uh, as metafilter and search the question and see how many people actually talk about that. If you you are things about in uh, online business about family about. Uh, the business about the infirmary film. So, so you want to find out people actually talk about what the question you are a about what. So you want to solve the problem, you want to know their concern and you can file and you can research and make a book and solve the problem. Now people will not buy the book and uh, you know book is useless to them. So you want to find you want to write something and to solve the problems. That's why my point. Okay. So next one you want to find um the um Com uh, commodalities and the patterns. Okay, so as you know, they will be used to help you find the table of contents, right? So from the question, you can actually kind of jot down what can come on and what's the pattern, and that will be the idea of table of contents. But that is not end. The final stage is identify the five best selling book in your niche and use the look inside feature and Amazon to buy just go to look inside they always give you a table content and look at each table content and compare to your table content which is just creating from your research and then doing is repurpose combine and improve okay the reason the repurpose combine improve because you want to make sure they also talk about something based on research. Maybe your research may be offer a little bit and you want to find out why they are best selling and how come your research is this way and that doesn't match. But most of the time if you do your research so the best selling book is probably um their style is probably uh, what you are actually research the the same kind of direction. So we are going to a uh, second point is going to uh like a Mary about top five book, uh, you can choose three, uh, five, I think uh, you can choose ten, but five I think is average. And use our own intelligence to figure out a logic table of contents that makes sense for our market. So this is how build table of content and next one is over deliver on your content. Then you go write. And of course you can write by yourself or you can have a, a, you have somebody actually write for you or you can have uh, write a draft for you or you can have a the ghostwriter writing entire thing for you. And I personally believe that uh, if you want to create the excellent content, you should choose one or two which is you write yourself or have somebody actually uh, do the uh, write the, base, the first draft for you. Um, the, uh, the, the benefit for that is because uh, I know a lot of people talk about is uh, writing all different kinds of slow content and using the uh, pen name and uh, uh, writing 20, 30 pages and um, charge like um, two ninety nine cents. That's that's a great way. Don't get me wrong. That's a great way to make passive income because uh, you can always go to uh, research the popular keyword and uh, to find out what's neat and to hire a ghostwriter to write twenty thirty page might be costly between seventy five dollars to one hundred one hundred dollars and use your pen name or use your company name and so in Amazon and uh, you can you can actually because you're doing that way you know uh, you can write the cooking quite a relationship write the, even the animal writing the kids writing the family writing the maybe volcano volcano writing <laughs> the history because anyway you can write all the different topics and lots of people are doing that there's nothing wrong with that but if you want to build your link, you want to be an expertise, the most important thing is become your own expertise, which means that you're going to write something that you're in the expertise, your niche is like uh, you're, if you're in the business opportunity, just write something on business opportunity, right? 
So this step I'm talking about here is a way to write your own book. And to write your own book and to rank, uh, to actually produce the the, be uh, the the most value possible uh, you can and everything. And don't worry about that how your book is gonna sell in something. But I truly believe if you focus on providing the value and good content and you truly understand how the keyword working, you know, pick up the right keyword for your book title, of course, right? You want to do that. And you should be able to have a good sales um and good ebay uh good ebook sales in amazon but you know, however if it's not don't worry because it's all takes time you know um uh like i break it i'm a musician as well i i have an album as well and i've quit album for two years and nobody listen nobody care and the only two years later some people starting email me say, oh yeah it's just your facebook me say how you how you play the solo of this song and something like that so don't worry about that. Just uh, keep doing, keep doing, and uh, no cause and effects mean, means you keep doing right. The cause of effect, you're doing this effort and you put this much, and cause of effect, that you should create this result. And same thing with the uh, read and solve. You read this amount and you will actually solve this amount. So don't give up. A lot of people give up the first, I wouldn't say 95% of people give up the first six months. Some people work so hard, so hard, okay, don't very work in like four, five, six months, and then they make any money. And uh, uh, I shouldn't, I won't say that their message is wrong, because it's clear, very, they're doing very hard, creating good content. They even probably have one ebook actually in Amazon, they probably even have their own information product. Maybe Intimate, you, maybe me, I did that. So, you don't see any result, but it's okay. It's okay, just slowly building your audience, you know, it's it's fine. I've been doing this for one year, you know, my first video, if you check YouTube, is a little bit more than one year, but like January last year. So I was in the online business very late, I admit that, even though I'm an IT person, I'm a software um, a developer, I creating website, uh, that's what I do full time uh, before, and right now my current job is financial software support. So I'm saying, I'm trying to say is, I was in the IT field, I'm actually my very first job in year 1999 is working a Fortune 500 company. Actually, I should say Fortune 3 company, a big company, and I was a webmaster, the only webmaster managed there for uh, the uh, uh, full of their, the not internal as the out uh, the the uh, the external website. So I'm not trying to say this in, in price. I'm uh, I just to impress upon you. You know, uh, uh, no matter what kind of skill you have, and no matter how much money you make your full time job. You know, I I have to admit that I get in the game very late. So I work very hard, very hard, and I don't see any result for well the first six months. And so much I see a little bit result, not too much result. And then for the past six months, I continue building my uh, list, build my list, and I have a little bit small list, which is not a lot, it's a, a really a small, you know, list, but enough for me to uh, doing the solo ads, which is um, uh, selling the promoting affiliate product with other people. But I didn't do that when when I first started. I do that actually after six months. You know, I was able to uh, have enough list. And then, but I on the side, I still doing the e still create my try to create my next info information product, and still doing the blogging. So this is how you actually build your online business. And of course, I know that that's a shiny object. Talk about step by step, and you're gonna make two thousand dollars tomorrow within twenty four hours. You know, some of the claim is so exaggerated, but I do know people actually make two thousand dollars per day. You know, that is true. But the point is, they doing this for a couple of years. If you just actually starting, even though you purchase the program and you follow all the step by step, it's still gonna take you weeks, you know, if not days, if not months, I mean years, take you weeks to actually get the system going on. And just assuming that you haven't dip your own hole, spend too much money, you know, in the program like I do, I spend lots of money, so many of it for, and dip your own hole and try to, you know, work hard, that, you know, try, to fill the hole and uh, basically, I mean, invest all your money and uh, <laughs> and try to, you know, uh, motivate, try to make your money and to, to fill the hole. That is not something that you want to do, okay? Um, you want to have a steady job and gradually spend 10%, gradually 20%, maybe 25% of your income doing inter online business until you make enough money and you turn quicker, quick, uh, make more money than your job so you can create 
wheelchair. Right now, I'm truly, I, I just want to tell you, I make more money. How much more? Um, probably close to twice amount of money. Uh, one, maybe our conservatives say 1.5 because you have to consider, you know, the cost, you know, the tax, everything. I would say 1.5 the amount of my my daytime income as a um, in IT field, and I, I'm still working in a job. And uh, I hope my boss is not reading this video. But uh, you know, I prepare very soon. You know, I'm going to have to tell my boss I'm so busy I cannot afford to work in the job. I have to do it my own night business. So I want you to do that as well. But it takes time. It really takes persistent energy, persuasion, and lots of Lots of the uh, personal dedication, you know, you really have to burn your bridge. And you really have to be, you know, like uh, like doing this. It's not like something that, okay, well, I'm just going to try. Try it won't work. You have to love, love it, right? To, you know, otherwise, if I tell you the truth, you know, I work uh, 9 to 5 and after feeding my dinner, uh, Taking my children, you know, homework something, and uh, 7:30 o'clock, and I sit on this table and recording a video and uh, writing the bra until 12 o'clock, 1 a.m. and go to sleep, and next day wake up at 5 o'clock, 6 o'clock, and if this is not live, you want, you know, then you probably is not, um, probably on my best market is not good for you, <laughs> you know. So I'm just be very frank to you. You need to actually have driving force. You want to. The, you know, love it, and uh, you something that keeps you, um, keep you um, sleep, sleeping late and wake up early. And uh, if this is not something, you know, drive you, have not kind of drive you, uh, you either have to find something to drive you, or you have to train yourself to drive you. And I, I, I do have a lot of program actually talk about how you actually can train yourself and to drive you by actually implementing the morning ritual, the, the noon ritual or night ritual, morning ritual, pretty much exercising, exercise, and very important, noon rituals, incantation, uh, visualization, um, you know, I'm talking about a lot of Tony Robbins, talk about stuff, Bob Proctor, uh, Brian Tracy, a night ritual, you know, reading, etc. But I'm trying to keep busy, because so otherwise the tools on which it is, uh, I really have passion about hope, uh, helping anyone. And so that's why I show you that's something in my blueprint. I doing everything that I'm showing in this video, and which is I don't have a chance to show you. Probably won't see this in the email I send to you. But if you have a chance to come to my video, this is something I'm doing. Okay, this is real, and this is not like tomorrow I'm gonna earn two thousand dollars. Thanks. But if you doing keep doing this and this and that, the people say they're making two thousand dollars per day, even two thousand dollars per hour. They originally starting doing this at the beginning. Thanks so much and watching the video and you have a very bright day. Thank you. Bye bye.